People tell me that I'm doing this the hard way when I got a little hand crusher over there, but the truth is, folks, I can pick up cans that I've got strode around and crush them a lot faster than I can using that little hand crusher over there takes a little time but as I keep saying it's not my livelihood and I got time I guess as long as I don't expire or croak or whatever you know I like I keep saying I'm on my bonus years because I've already lived past my life expectancy And the reason I got all this stuff piled up is I just slacked off of getting it done. Now, these come from Miss Caroline. And a lot of times they go ahead and crush some of their can switches. Neat. I could be getting a whole lot more cans if I just make some contact with some of these neighbors that that uh, throw away cans and some and some they. I've got this one neighbor in particular. They they have uh, probably. Every Tuesday and every Friday when I go by there, there's probably somewhere between 15 and 30 cans that they got in there with their garbage and stuff, but they're in plastic bags and they're tied shut. The only way I can get them out of there is to rip the bag open. Now, if, if, uh, if the bags was such that I could open them and get them out without trashing the bags or if there was another trash can there that I could put the the uh, bag in that I've ripped open um, I'm not going to rip open bags that, that's just going to be sitting there with holes all in it um, I'm just not going to do it. I'm tempted to, but no, it's just not good to leave, leave, as some people keep reminding me, you don't leave a mess, and I try not to leave a mess. I might overlook something at times, but for the most part, a lot of times I leave it and better shape than what I found it. And, oh yeah, now, these here, this is the artsy part of me. I like to take, these are globes that goes on ceiling. Oh shoot, that one's cracked, so that one's no good. I'll bet the other one's cracked too. Let me pitch it over. Yeah, I believe it's cracked too. Or is it? Yep, it's cracked too. I take and make a base for them things and make a little vase. They make neat little, sometimes paint some trim or something on some gold trim and, or gold leaf them. They're really pretty, and most of the time people that see them want them, especially the ones you do in gold leaf. 
And that gold leaf is the real deal, or at least the gold leaf I use is the real deal. Um, but there's an artist in me that wants to come out, but actually I don't have time to do that. I got too much to do, and uh, I am not gonna trash that cord there. Uh, but as I was saying, I am finding so much stuff that I've had packed off in a corner somewhere and that I had forgot about. And I, and most of it is is uh, like aluminum and brass and stuff. I got a whole lot more aluminum than I thought I had. Break this one open. My grandson, the oldest one, has pretty much quit on me. He got upset because he thought we were going to, well, I planned on going to the scrapyard yesterday, but once I realized I got so much more stuff that needs processing, I wanted to process it and do it in one trip. Now he wasn't happy about that. He was not happy. Um, I think all these sprites come from this Caroline. I'm pretty sure it did. Right now, I'm just a one-man show. Right now. Let's, you know. I want to get some money, more money in that account for my new scooter I want to get. You know, this thing here, I can't, I don't think I can, I can't, I can't crush them like I do. So I'm going to throw that over there in that pile. Um. And he was supposed to be getting all the wire up, and I see a bunch of wire still laying around. Somebody left a radiator in my yard the other day. I don't know who it is, and it had a Michigan license plate on it. Uh, we were supposed to get a tropical storm this weekend, but it looks like it's veered off and going up the coast again, up north somewhere.
There goes that lady that's, uh, she's in her 80s. And she wishes she would die. She said she's had a good life and she's done everything she wants to do. And she's done. Uh, I'd like to talk to her some more, but I might all stay out of that. I believe this is some of Caroline's stuff too. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna put that uh, Wilton um, uh, vice on uh, Craigslist. That's a three hundred dollar vice. It's a brand name. Personally, I wouldn't pay three hundred dollars for it, but if it's if it retails for around three hundred and it's like brand new, uh, I'm gonna put it on Craigslist for a hundred dollars. And uh, there's something else I was gonna put on Craigslist. Man, I wish all this was cleaned up. Gosh Almighty! Whew. I am so. Overwhelmed. I'm just. <laughs> Ain't no need to me. Dauber, you need to get your butt in the shed there. Let's see. I got so much. Let's see. That's gonna. That needs to go. I need to take the motor off of that. I need to take the motor off of that. I am thinking, let's see. thinking we'll see I won't cut into that Yeah, that's aluminum, so that need, that needs to go in here where I can uh, sit down, Dover. Oh, what a mess. <laughs> it don't look no better than it did yesterday. <laughs> oh, gosh. I swear, folks, if I ever get this cleaned up and caught up, I am not, I repeat, I will not 
just pile everything up in a pile and forget about it. I will, as, as I bring it in the next day or that evening, I'm going to work on processing it. I'm not going to pile it up. I swear, I promise. <sighs> Dang. This is awful. It's just so much stuff, you know. <laughs> and you know, and the stuff I had to leave outside and cover it up with a tarp, if that hurricane, that darn had hit here, it would have blowed that stuff all the kingdom come and buy it. Oh, ow, 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 toe pain, toe pain, gosh almighty. Toe pain on the toe that I don't have no more. I ain't had it for two years. Oh. Gee whiz, how can that hurt like that? What the hell is that? That's a damn, I don't know what that, what is that? You see that thing? See it? I guess it's got a purpose. <laughs> I'm kicking that thing outside in the dirt if I can. Outside, buddy, you ain't got no business in here. You better dig you a hole somewhere. Folks, I'm going to tell you what's the truth. I ought to be ashamed of myself. For getting myself into it. What is that? And then, uh, I, I'm, I, uh, just look at this mess. You know, it's just a habit of throwing stuff and not putting it back. Is that trash? That's probably a magnet, but I don't want it. And I got a bunch of shred out there that I need somebody to come pick up. But the trouble is, they want to charge me now to come pick it up because they're getting so little for it at the scrapyard. It ain't worth it to them. And I understand that. Ow, right on my foot. What am I sitting on now? That's going in there, the magnet is going on here. I I'm telling you, it's just, there's another piece of copper. Oh, uh, and I've got what is this? That plugs into something. I hope I can find the thing that plugs into my uh, strobe light that I should be using when I do videos in here. Oh, uh, is this copper? No, that's aluminum. And now it's just... It is not like it used to be. Not like it used to be. But I probably got what? I probably got 200 pounds of steel shred out there that that all I can get for that 200 pounds is maybe five dollars. So they're not going. Scrappers ain't gonna drive over here to my place to pick up 200 pounds of shred Unless they just happen to be driving by 
then they might do it. But if, they, if I call somebody up, they're going to want me to pay them. I don't know. I can't stay out here much longer because I've got my live coming up at... Oh. Uh, my live coming up at 5. And I was wanting to make some notes about some stuff I wanted to discuss on my live, but I didn't get my notes. That is for putting stuff in your air conditioner on your car. Um. Let's see. And come Monday or Tuesday, I have got. I have got. What is that? That's nails. I don't want to throw them away. That's the one I'm put it in there for right now. That's going in there for right now. It's not where it belongs. That's copper. That's going in there for right now. Here's some gold. Or ram sticks, whatever you want to call them. I sell this ram separate. Uh, I'm putting my... I've got four or five laptops. And I got to looking on eBay, and there's laptops that says non-working as is, and some of them things is going for thirty or forty dollars, which I don't understand why. Uh, I was going to microscrap them. Uh, laptop but you know if i can get 10 15 dollars a piece for them on ebay that's what i'm gonna do of course i'm banned from ebay i've been banned am i recording yeah i'm banned from ebay and i keep saying i'm gonna go over that with you and tell you what happened there it's really my fault but it is what it is. I'm banned indefinitely, and that pretty much means lifetime, I guess. But I can still, my, my grandson will put it on his site and sell it for me. Uh, <sighs> yeah, I was shocked to find out them laptops were selling for that much. So I was going to scrap them, you know, and get the CPUs and the boards and all that stuff out of them, but shoot. If, if non-working laptops is going for upwards of 10 to $40 a piece, I might as well put them for welfare as one deal and see what we can get. Um... Oh, mercy. And make sure that buyer knows they are as is. A lot of people, I, while I was on eBay, um, they'll buy something and you got on there as is where it is. And they turn around and lodge a complaint. You see all these screws here and this stuff here? I don't, I hate trash and stuff like that. That's a blade from my, what you call it, saw. So. Um. Let's see, what time is it? I don't... It is... 2.21. I can stay out here to 3, but I have to take my butt in. To 
of the house I got to get myself ready for for um alright I'm gonna slide that down there slide that down there and all these little allen wrenches is part when I was in here there's my there's my channel locks I was wanting um that's gonna go in there now I need something I need a Ah, oh, there's something. I put them screws in uh, right there. Yeah, I'm gonna put them screws in there. I hate, right, you know. I'm not doing much building of anything anymore. I wish a lot of times I'd have never got rid of my my woodworking tools two years ago. I did. Let's go. Right there. That's an oscillator. In there. That go in there. It's all metal, it adds up. I just... <sighs> That's lead. Just not organized, folks. I'm trying to get there, though. Um, i tell you what, my... My line of thinking right now is what I need to do is get leave the messes alone and get all the stuff that I can process, you know, micro scrap and get some dollars out of and uh Get that process and get it the heck out of here. And then clean up the messes. And try to get it organized. I may be wrong, but that seems like the simplest as that go. No, that's, I know what that is, but it ain't nothing. Oh. Uh, and I need to get all my... Drivers, my torques, my Phillips, my. I need to get it all back up in the rack where it belongs. I wish I'd have kept my drill press. I'd make me some blocks of wood that I can stick these down in. But oh no, I, good lord, I need to, uh, 
Oh no. I had to get rid of the drill. I had I had a 12 inch table saw, a 12 inch craftsman planer, I had a drill press, I had all kind of routers and plunge routers and uh, I had uh, belt sanders, I had the whole nine yards. And the landlord was complaining about me having that shop out here. I had a, a shelter and everything on it. And they got, it was mainly his wife that was doing the plane and complaining. I don't know why she was. It wasn't hurt nothing. And they was complaining. And I got really what's in here. Oh, this is chips. Yeah, these are chips. I wish there was somebody I could. I don't know if that's any good. No, that's no good. Um, what is that? This is, I don't know. That'll go in there. There might be some copper in it. Um, I'm gonna put that's a selfie stick. Put that in there. That's gonna go up there. I wonder what this is. That's another plug of some kind. What is it? AC DC adapter. Input 120, output 12 volts. Um, this is a bunch of screws. That'll go in that. Oh, uh, gee, and this here is magnets. This is all, oh boy. That'll go over there. That's a big magnet right there. Oh boy, can I get him off there? Pretty dang strong. I wish I could get this separated from that. Cause the magnet, the magnet is not this. Oh boy, that is strong. Mm. Pick that up. Yes, it will. How would I go about getting that thing? That would be what is holding that on there. And what is that copper wire around that? Uh, I have got. I have got oh and you know these little these magnets right here comes off of 
the hard drive inside the hard drives and them little suckers is strong for no bigger than they are oh <laughs> shit maybe it's stuck that oh oh boy mm. these are all pretty strong man i don't know why I don't know. What is this? That goes in here. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Always magnets are this doing out here I don't oh I know what I a few months back I had a runny nose and didn't have no tissue so I brought it out here I'll put that in there for right now um that I think that is brass Um, sheesh, 